What's up everybody? Rolling into episode 9 here. We're going to talk about Facebook Business Manager. The pros, the pains, and the tips. Number one, Facebook Business Manager is a good thing. It allows agencies to have more than one client under a business manager account. And the importance of this is so that essentially you can have the ability to deploy boosted posts or targeted ads, newsfeed or sidebar ads, with different credit cards on file. So you can have each one of your clients have their own credit card on file and associated with their client account under your Facebook Business Manager account. They can share access with you, they can keep access. That's the good part. That's the main reason to use Facebook Business Manager. Where it gets a little confusing is you have to have page access and ads manager access within your Facebook Business Manager account in order to do everything that you need to do as an agency slash advertiser for your clients or your own businesses. You, you know, you, you might have multiple Facebook pages of your own that you want to share with your own coworkers at your company. And so that's another reason to use Facebook Business Manager even if you're not an agency. So let's start with the easy part. The easy part is getting page access into your Facebook Business Manager account. The simplest way to do that is just to simply request that the current admin of the Facebook page that you're wanting to add, just simply add you as a top level admin to the page. This is quite simple. Then, within Facebook Business Manager, you can add yourself through a simple step-by-step -step process of requesting access to an existing page. Once you get page access, you can post on that page's behalf as well as boost posts on that page's behalf. What you can't do is you can't schedule ads on that page's behalf. So the tricky part is now getting ads manager access mainly because in my experience about 99% of the Facebook population even if they've deployed ads before through their regular Facebook account doesn't realize that Facebook even has something called ads manager but every time that you've ever boosted a Facebook post or placed an ad on Facebook you've done so through what's called an ads manager account. It's the platform that you go into after you click promote or boost or any of those calls to action on your company page or your business page on Facebook. So as an agency, we need to get ads manager access to deploy campaigns for our clients. And so it's a pain for the clients and the agency has to know what the heck they're doing. So I'm gonna help you out with a few tips here. The best way to do it is to go into Facebook Business Manager, Business Settings, the blue button at the top right. Then go into Add Accounts on the left, left-hand navigation. Then request access to an, ad, to an existing Ads Manager account. Chances are, the person or business that you're going to be partnering with already has an ads manager account. They just don't know it. And then what you're going to do is send an invitation to them to add you by typing in their business name. Now they're going to get a notification. But they're not going to see this notification because it's going to be in their ads manager. They're going to think that they've already added you but they haven't. They've added you as a page admin, but not as an ads manager admin. This is critical. They're gonna think that they've added you, but they haven't. We're gonna hit on this in the next segment.
So what you're gonna do is instruct your client or partner to go into their ads manager account. Now the easiest way for them to probably find this is to go to their Facebook page logged in as an admin and scroll down and look in the bottom left and there's either a text link called go to ads manager or there's a blue promote button. When you click that button and click follow the steps to promote your page, you'll eventually get into ads manager. It'll be gray and you'll know it's a different color and you'll see a number up in the top left hand side. Also what we call a hamburger menu. Click the hamburger menu and you'll see account settings. You'll click account settings and you'll see your invitations underneath account settings. And under invitations, then you'll see the request. Your client will see the request that you sent to grant them access to the ads manager account. Once you do that, instruct them to click the accept invitation. Once they do that, you will then have to go back into your Facebook business manager account go into your business settings and then add yourself to the ads manager on the left hand side it's a very convoluted process but once you get in then you'll be able to have all the access you need to deploy all the ads and boosted posts that your little heart desires for your clients i hope this helps have a great day